So, Naran, we are discussing about the stop and start processes, right? So, so already I think we know how to start and stop it as well. So, but just once again, I want to show you. So, in a Windows systems, it's very simple. There is a SAP MC. Then, so just right click on the SID. Then you can start and the stop. You can start and stop it. That is very simple. Okay, and also we can also. Uh, use the stop uh, SAP start and uh, SAP dia host that commands also we can host it windows you know we can use the SAP MC so management console so that we can use it here right so the only thing is the Linux systems Linux based systems how to start it right so Linux based systems so we can use the stop SAP stop SAP and host name or stop SAP all. So stop SAP, maybe only that only one instance you want to stop it. Then the instance number, whatever the instance you want to start it, that instance. Or if you want to start only ACS, then start SAP ACS instance number. So like that, if you use the command after the start SAP, if you use the these arguments, so then it will stop it. So I don't want to start or stop individually. I want to start it. Uh, so I want to start it all. All means everything will be started. Application servers, AACS, everything will be started in the order wise here. Some people, sometimes people will use the start SAP R3 as well. So it will start the R3 system. So sometimes people will use the J2EE as well. So Java systems. So the command is common, stop SAP and the start SAP, the command is common. But only thing is the, the procedure of the, the, the syntax, the, the suffix, the suffix is different, the different ways we can start it and stop it here, right? So sometimes, so nowadays in the S4 systems and the latest version of the kernels, we will use the SAP control commands. Why? Because stop SAP, start SAP will not work in the the higher environments, higher kernel environments here. So here we need to use the so SAP control command, SAP control, right? Iphone NR, <coughs> SAP control iPhone NR, then instance number, instance number, then iPhone function, so iPhone function, then so then stop service the stop service and SID, then SAP control, iPhone, NR, instance number, iPhone function, then stop system, then start system, reverse order, start system. So these commands, we have to use it here. In the latest versions, SAP control command, we have to use it here, right? SAP control command, we have to use it in the systems here, right? So let me show you now here, why because since our servers are stopped status here, so if we go ahead and complete starting procedure, then you will come to know the how to stop it and how to start it here, right? So then, so let's take the so Linux first here, okay? So Linux systems here. Linux is not up still. Let's wait. Okay, so stop SAP, start SAP, control commands, we can use it here, right? Suppose if you go to the, so our KPS4 system, this is installed on the Linux box here, right? So here, you can go to here, then what we can do, let me increase the size, change settings, appearance, 
change and again okay so here so our system is the so n1h right then you can switch to the n1h adm n1h adm so just you can use the stop sap all stop sap all it will stop the only this instances will be stopped status right so it is stopping only instances are stopping status here right see it is stopping here so all all means whatever the instances are there whatever the application servers are there everything will be stopped status everything will be stopped status here everything will be stopped status here so that one so we can see it here that one we can see it here the linux only it's very simple with sad adm so we have to use this one so stop sap start sap commands we have to use it here So then you cannot access now. See here, you cannot access the system. So connecting, connecting, connecting. System it to be shut down status here. See connecting. So how can I check the status means? So same, uh, you can use the commands. I will show you the commands to check the status here. See why it is taking some time? Why it is taking some time here, right? So it is cleaning up the resources. There is a shared memory resources shared memory resources it is getting clean up clean it is cleaning up here all the shared memory resources are cleaning up here that is what here it is happening here so shared memory the resources are cleaning up so if it is the more shared memory segments are there segments are there so it will take some time to shut down completely completely here so it's not shut down completely that's why still see it is trying to establish the connection to the n1h n1h why because it's not completely down so only partially stopped the some of the process here but still it is waiting for the clean up the resources clean up the resources and shared memory segments and everything here so that is the one thing i think now we got the so three see here now we got the uh, screen so means immediately the shutdown got happened here right so sometimes what happens sometimes what happens there is a shared memory related issues in the linux based systems in that we can use the clean ipc and what is the your instance number and the remove that instance remove that will be clean up the all the shared memory segments and everything will be removed here everything will be removed here so clean ipc clean ipc and these things if you use it that will be cleaned up here so then now you can use the start sap all or you can also use the sap control command sap control iphan nr nr means instance number then iphan function okay iphan function here then start system start system here so then system is started here simple then then you can go to the same then yes yes you started so individually we have to start it here now so then you need to start the application server application server yes yes instance number and application server instance number you need to use it then sir how to check whether it is started or not here right so then get process list get process list to use it here it will tell you okay dispatcher igs everything is green 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 right it's green so now try to start it now yes sap is started now sap is started now here you can see the sap is started now so like this we need to start the systems here we have to start the systems in this case here okay so that is the starting of the in the linux systems how to start it means this is the way we need to start the systems here so windows it's simple 
right indoor city is very simple here just go to here any service it's in the well made suppose there, suppose like example this is a web dispatcher right right click start it then it will ask the password then you can enter the password right then this is the also our ecd system start it right this is also will be started right and so our nw1 system right this is also so it's not started you see you can start it at a time all at a time you can start it here right so that is also possible power is fluctuating <clears throat> so you can start it if you want you can start it and w1 so start it then it will be started status here right it will start it here so you can start it so you can see it is started web dispatcher that is started here right our this is also getting started here right yes started here then nw1 nw1 also will be started status it will be start it will start it here so it is started it is starting nw1 also starting see so like that we have to start it suppose we have the one more system so that is also i will show you how to start it here in case of how to start it means so log into the os level operating system level so we can okay so here what we can do here so suppose you want to start the you want to start the system suppose in this case suppose like s4 on a system then connect to the mc adm then if you use the start sap command start sap command the command will not found why because start sap will not work in the higher version systems here so then you need to check the so profiles so profiles means you can see the os level os level profiles here right OS level profile directories. So you can see here. So here SAP control iPhone NR. So ACS. So 05 iPhone function. Right. Then start system. Simple. Then so 04. Then start system. Then this is also will be started here right so then get process list so which means to check the get process list here then it will give you the information it will give you the information here get process list here so it is in the yellow starting status here dispatcher mainly thing is we need to check the dispatcher starting in the yellow status here it is green so it is green means it is started here also everything is green so all are started all our servers are started status here this is also started status here right so our this is also started status here yes started so control sap control command sap control command will help you here will sap control command otherwise some systems with the lower version customs just use the sap start sap all then this will start the automatically it will start it will check the database then it will check it will start the ACS in the instance then application servers will be started some systems here automatically right so depends upon the kernel it will start the systems automatically here however so here the first whenever you want to start it here complete system outages full outages then you need to start the DB then ACS then so SAP app servers you have to start it here right that is the procedure so whenever any stopping procedure completely you need to stop it there is an outage or there is a os upgrade people ask you to stop it then reverse order then sap app servers pass then acs then db you need to stop it completely here right so there is a order there is a order to follow so this is the order to follow the systems sometimes people may ask you to only start the sap start srv process so sap control same sap control iphone nr so instance number of the sap control process here then iphone function right then start service sid this one you have to use it here right then stop service start survey here we already covered it so start service sid 
and stop service SID. So then it will start the, it will restart the restart service. Then it will restart the, so this one. So SAP control command, SAP, the control command will, will there is a syntax of the SAP control command here. Let me show you. So SAP control iPhone help. So then you will get the syntax. So you will get the syntax here. See, get process list. Then, so then SAP control. So you can see that these all are the SAP control commands checks only here, right? So SAP control, iPhone NR instance number, right? iPhone NR instance number. So then you can use the this methods. So stop service, start service, restart service, right? Get process list, get trace files. So these under the methods you have to use it here in the in the last in the last suffix what you have to use it means so this is the stop service start these are the methods this is the common iphone function up to here common then end of the end of the suffix what you have to do stop bootstrap so you can see the index so restart the service then start the service stop the service right the so restart the instance right get alert trace so you can see the syntax right so these are all the things you can use it here these are all the things you can use it here to get the so you, with usage of the sap control command sap control command here even though if you don't know here start system all all means everything ses dialog abap java trex nq hdb so even anything java abap any system the sap systems you can stop it you can start it you can use this syntax to stop it here so whenever if you don't know the syntax, the particular, then just use the SAP control with SAD ADM, just use the hyphen help. Okay. This will help you to get the syntax. What method I have to use it? Is it the stop service or start service? Is it a restart service? So what you have to use it here? It will give you the clear information. Okay. It will give you the information here. Okay. So this is the starting and stopping the systems here.